there are always some interesting things that come up during an election campaign where candidates are asked for their opinion on certain decisions that have been made at city council. Uh, one of the decisions by the police services board has generated a lot of discussion and that's the decision to purchase 45 tasers for their frontline officers. The tasers uh, provide a different level of enforcement for officers and allow police officers to uh, more or less um, disengage uh, a person who's being aggressive or a person who is being uh, unruly and, and resisting arrest. Tasers are not intended to uh, do any kind of permanent harm to an individual. Tasers are intended to uh, diffuse a, a potentially dangerous situation and and I know because our youngest son is a police officer in Peel that tasers have in many cases and many times uh, stopped a confrontation and a, a physical assault of police officers uh, where unruly people, uh, let's say at 2 o'clock in the morning coming out of a bar are aggressive, they're, they're intoxicated and all they want to do is fight and resist arrest if they're in, involved in a, an altercation. So uh, the decision by the Police Services Board is, is totally, uh, it, it has my total support. I, I believe that tasers will provide a, a level of safety for officers and will prevent an awful lot of um, situations from escalating into uh, more dangerous uh, incidents. So I think I, I commend the Police Services Board and uh, will definitely do whatever I can to help police officers do a, a very difficult job and make sure that our streets and uh, our, uh, our community is safe. And if there's one message that I would like to get out to anybody who feels like they they can come in and they can ride roughshod over Sudbury, I would like them to understand that no, Sudbury is not available for the taking. And as a city councillor, I will make sure that our police officers are well equipped to keep this place safe.